Hello students, in the video, the transport of sperm cells in the male reproductive system. So this is very important to need perspective because repetitive are catered. Okay, male accessory ducts in an pathina, ready testis, vasa efferentia, epididymis and vas difference. Uh, so in the male accessory ducts, it's a series of tubes that transport sperms from the testis to the urethra. Okay, so accessory ducts in an an pathom male, ready testis, vasa efferentia, epididymis, vas difference. So in the order, in the order, in the order than transport ahu. this is important first speminiferous tubule produce agar sperm it will sperms it will uh, open into the vasa efferentia through this reti testis okay then in the reti testis in the vasa efferentia ko, then it opens into epididymis epididymis in the, it is located along the posterior surface of the testis so, the testis ko above situate ko, then it ascends to the abdomen through this vas difference ascends na mal abdomen ko ko, and it loops over the urinary bladder okay uh, so, uh, it receives a duct from the seminal vesicle and opens into the urethra as the ejaculatory duct. So, in the picture, parenge, this is the vas difference. This is the seminal vesicle. So, it receives a duct from the seminal vesicle. So, duct is nothing but a tube. So, in the tube, it receives the vas difference. Then, it's open, uh, it opens into ejaculatory duct. So, this is the ejaculatory duct. So, this is the um, the ejaculatory duct da, in the sperms are stored pani and transport pano from the testis to the outside through urethra. Okay. So the urethra under the, it originates from the urinary bladder and extends through the penis to its external opening called urethral meters. Okay. Um, so this is the about the transport of sperms from the testis to the urethra. Students, in the video, you will be useful. Arna, kindly subscribe to my channel. This is the main video link. Thank you.